Hey guys, welcome to today's show. So today we are going to be turning these into this. Let's go. Now the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to turn your barbecue on because we're going to be smoking these and making it the right way. So we're going to want to keep this at around 400 degrees Fahrenheit. So typically baba ganoush is made by roasting eggplant over a wood burning fire. So we are going to get that smoked effect, which makes a really good baba ganoush by using wood chips and making a nice little wood chip packet. And next, we're just going to poke holes in our eggplant. So we are going to place our little wood chip packet in the center. So we want that to get smoky, so we're just going to let that heat up a bit. So the temperature has leveled out pretty much at 400. So we're going to throw these eggplant on. And we're just going to rotate them about every eight to 10 minutes. So we'll know that they're done when they are deflated. So it'll probably take about 20 to 30 minutes. Hey guys, what's up? So if you're enjoying this recipe, please give me an eggplant down below. Not the emoji, the word eggplant. Thanks. All right, so it's been about 10 minutes. So we're just gonna rotate these. And in the meantime, we're going to talk about our other ingredients. So I have four simple ingredients, some minced garlic, some sea salt, some lemon juice, and some tahini. That's it. Super simple. So we're just going to wait for this eggplant to cook, and then we'll put it all together. All right, it's been another 10 minutes, so we're just going to check. So as you can see, these are starting to collapse. We're just going to flip them one more time. And I'm probably going to give it another six minutes, I think. All right, so I'm thinking these should be pretty good here. You can see that they've definitely collapsed on themselves. They're nice and charred. So this next step, along with the wood chips, are totally optional, but to make it a traditional baba ganoush, like I said, what we're going to do is we're going to throw this little packet of smoke into my bowl here and then we're going to stuff these eggplant in there shut that and then we're going to put a lid on this and we're going to let that smoke for even longer let those fluids drip in um, I know some people aren't a fan of smoke so this is entirely up to you but that is what gives baba ganoush its amazing flavor so we're gonna let this sit for about 20 minutes we're just gonna want to peel the flesh off of this so obviously you want this to be cool enough to handle we don't want you burning yourself So once all of the flesh has been removed and you've got all the charred skin, we're just going to give this a chop. And then we'll add it to our tahini, lemon juice, garlic, and sea salt mixture. There you go guys, a delicious baba ganoush. So typically this is served with pita chips or fresh veggies as a dip. I'm actually gonna be serving it as a topping on our baked potatoes that I also made earlier. And then I'm gonna be serving it alongside a fresh tomato and cucumber salad. So super simple. I hope you enjoyed this recipe and don't forget to eat your fork and vegetables.